I was raised in a very religious family. My father was a Protestant minister, so me and my sisters, we spent a lot of time in the church when young. I, I always lived in big cities like Sao Paulo, London, and Rio. But in 2006, I decided to move away from Sao Paulo and go to Lençóis in the heart of Bahia, in the heart of Brazil to start a, a research about the local folklore and the traditions, the rituals, the processions. And this was my main, the first intent when I went there. But the second intent was to develop a, a site-specific work that could embrace the whole town. I want to paint the city, I want to paint Lençóis, inspired by their traditions, but not an embellishing project, but more like a re religious, uh, like a belief confrontation one, in a sense. It took me two years to finish this project, and in the end of the second year, um, I was invited by the by some of the elderly in the community to refurbish the local chapel. The chapel of Santa Luzia. So neither the diocese or the mayor were taking care of the chapel because it was located in a really run-down area. I took it as a personal project and worked on it for two months. So when I finished, I kept on going there just to visit. And one day, I saw two old ladies going inside the chapel. I saw them on their knees and with the rosaries in hand, they were praying to one of the images I have painted. For me, it was uh, frightening and impressive to see the new dimension my work had taken inside that space. Because even though I'm not a believer, I knew that from that moment on, those images didn't belong to me anymore. They have been taken. So now when I moved back to Sao Paulo in 2008, I started working in different medias like sculpture and also installations and very inspired by symbology. The temple is a symbol. It's a symbol that can carry other symbols. So I decided to make a series of installations inspired by, by symbology, but in, in the form of temples. This is the first one in 2009. I made this installation at MASP, the Museum of Sao Paulo. And then in also in the uh, Museo Afro Brasil and in the Museum of Contemporary Arts in uh, San Diego. But I think I like to, uh, my idea is to make a place of contemplation, not to reinforce any dogma, but to stimulate the, you know, the opposite, to stimulate the critical thought. I have also worked some of these installations, some of these temples in the public spaces. So uh, last year I went to Portugal and uh, to make two installations in Lisbon. And after traveling throughout the north of the country, visiting different uh, workshops of crafts, craftsmen, learning some of their, uh, about their, their folklore and some of their sculpting techniques, I went back to Lisbon and did two installations in, in the street, two temples. And then I held a performance there, inspired by the traditions I've learned in the north, and to, to do the masks and the costumes that my character would use, using also the sculpting techniques that I've learned from the masters. Now I'd like to share my next project with you. It will take place in the seaside of the state of Rio not in touristic places, not at all, but in small fishermen villages. I remember when I arrived in Lençóis in the first two months, one day I was painting a mural, and these two small kids came to me and they pointed to my bucket of paint and they said, what is that? I said, it's paint. And then they pointed to my brush and said, what is that? And I said, it's a brush. They're like, ah. Oh. And then Another kid, an older kid, came and said, ah, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? I said, because that, that's what I do. And he was like, is that uh, political advertising? 
I said, no, but at that moment I realized that they have never seen anyone like painting a mural or like any like mural in the street or anything. Uh, so what I want to do is, uh, with this project, I want to work within the community to insert art in their daily lives. And I want to work in the with, with their working tools. There are the fishing boats, but I also want to work in other surfaces, like the houses, the walls, the, the boardwalk, uh, collaborating to redesign the landscape. Thank you.